New controversy as Johnny Depp makes his red carpet comeback. Everybody's gone hysterical. <laughs> Nearly a year since his legal victory over Amber Heard, fans went crazy for Johnny today at the Cannes Film Festival. The actor signed autographs, posed for selfies, and even got a standing ovation as he entered the theater with the director of his new film, Jean de Berry, which opened the film festival. Cette jeune femme est mon entourage. Johnny winked at the camera, seemingly unfazed by the fact that Amber supporters had launched a campaign using the hashtag CanYouNot, condemning the festival for celebrating the man she accused of abuse. Depp's movie also resulted in a tense moment for Oscar winner Brie Larson. This is new video of her today on the red carpet. She's on the jury judging the movies in Cannes. Well, I'm curious how you feel about Johnny Depp's film opening the festival, and do you plan to see it? You're asking me that? Yes. Um... I don't know, I'm sorry, I don't understand the correlation, or why me specifically? Oh, just, you were on the advisory council, uh, celebrity advisory council for Time's Up. I think the Johnny Depp case has been very well played out in American and national media. There's been some controversy about that film being chosen to play out of competition in open can. So I'm just curious if you will see it. Um, well, you'll see, I guess, if I'll see it. And um, I don't know how I'll feel about it if I do. <laughs> But you can't deny Johnny's on a roll. More proof? Dior is doubling down on its relationship with Depp. The cosmetics giant reportedly just re-signed the actor to promote its fragrance and will pay him upwards of $20 million for three years. And it's looking more likely we'll see the return of Captain Jack Sparrow. What can you tell us about pirates? And will we see Johnny Depp? I'm just gonna ask you straight out. We'll see, I would love it. I would love to have him in the movie, that's all I can tell you. As for Johnny's ex, well, Amber Heard has been keeping a low profile and has apparently moved far from Hollywood to Spain. That's her in Madrid visiting a museum with a friend. The actress also reportedly bought a house there for almost $2 million.